Everybody could copy Pythagorean theorem on a post-it, please. All right, nice. All right, place that post-it on the problem that uses the Pythagorean theorem in your homework. Nice job. Okay. You know what your next assignment is. I want to take I want you to take your post-it that says Pythagorean theorem and put it on the problem that's going to use the Pythagorean theorem. All right, what was your key that that was the problem that you were going to label Pythagorean theorem? The triangle. Has a triangle. Looks good. You're going to create four post-its. The first post-it is going to have the word proportion on it. The next one, rate of change. That's slope. Pythagorean. And the last one is percent proportion. Okay, you have a template that has an example of those four problems. What I'd like for you to do is take those post-its and I want you to stick them on the template part that it has, is the example of those post-its. Go ahead. Fantastic. Okay, you have four word problems. Those word problems are going to use the template to be solved. So I want you to figure out first, let's look at this first problem, read it and figure out which of those post-its is going to cover that. Go ahead, what does that say? Find the slope of a line that includes points 0, 3, and 4, 1. What is the rate of change of the line? What, in, what is the equation of the line? All right, nice. Can you find the right post-it? Beautiful. All right, and stick it so you can still see the problem. Perfect. Now it leaves a big gap, a big opening, where you're going to solve that problem. All right, that's the next okay, step. So you put the data in there, the point zero three and four one. So then you found the change in x and the change in y, and then you've put that in the template. The change in y is two, change in x negative four, and you simplified that to. Um, 1 over negative 2 or negative 1 half, and that's right. Nice you have job. three more problems. You're going to find the right post-it for that problem, and as you do it, you're going to open up a space to do the problem. So when I take off the proportion problem and put it where it goes, you notice now we open up a space for that problem to be solved.